So the, the, first free throw, the first free throw looked like short and left. How'd you kind of get your composure together to switch that second one? Joe, uh, so they'll be desperate, obviously, in the next game. I'm sure the MO for you guys will be just to be as desperate as them and just match them. Yeah, just, you know, play our energy, play our style of basketball. Uh, you know, I feel like we can play better. Uh, but overall, I think that our defense was pretty good. Uh, how stuck to the game. How, 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 bad, how, bad, how bad were the needles in your foot feeling tonight? What was it like? I'm happy with one. Uh, we don't have a lot of time to, to rest and get as much treatment as I can. Be ready for game four. Found a way, man. It's all about finding a way. And uh, that's what we did tonight. Sunday is the one year anniversary for your favorite. You were one of the first things that we did for the game. You were one of the first things that we It was a dark day. It was a dark day for us. And we, won, we won that playoff game, but it was a dark day. I'm getting hurt as well. I'll probably remember that day for the rest of my life. Did you think you were that bad? You were one of the first guys there, if I recall. I was hoping it wasn't going to be too serious. I was hoping it wasn't going to be too serious. I was hoping it wasn't going to be too serious. I was hoping it wasn't going to be too serious. Their interior defense has been you know, susceptible for, for much of the season, and, and Carlos really took advantage of that, and he has against the Nets all season, is and they can't stop him. Yes. Yes. He's playing, but he's playing at a very high level. Um, you know, I think that you know, Carlos is playing very humble right now. You know, he's really stepping up his defense, and scoring, and scoring uh, very high efficiency. So he's huge. He's been huge for us. And, Happy for Carlo. Have you seen him raise his game? I mean, it, yeah. he's playing at a level you haven't seen. You know? Yeah, I think he's playing his best basketball right now. Uh, since, 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 since. Do you think he gets the credit for what he does on defense? Is, do you think he gets the credit for what he does on defense? Do I think he gets the credit for what he does on defense? Uh, well, I, th I think that you know, he's, he's, yeah, he's been really stepping up the last, you know, the last, since the beginning of the playoffs. I think his defense is, is really Joey Tom always talks about how Lou is the glue in the team. Is that the way you guys view him as well? Um, you know, I don't really view him as glue. I view him as my, you know, as a, as a big piece of the team. He played huge for us tonight. Uh, he carried us offensively, defensively. And he just does everything. You know, he's definitely a huge part of what we do. Teams can get in a you know, rhythm or whatever offensively or in a zone. Can you get in that defensively? What would happen in the second quarter? I mean, I think our defense is all about trusting the next, the next man, making sure the next man you know, does his job. So our mindset is just, you know, just do your job, do what you're supposed to do, and believe that the next person is going to do it. We work on defense like an hour a day. So, um, you know, today was probably one of the best defense of the year. Is it instinctive, or do you have to think about when you're playing defense like that? Is it just know where to be? No, I mean, you know, we have a we have a good game plan every every game. Uh, we're, we're prepared. Uh, you know, it's, like I said, it's all about trusting the next, the next man and making sure he does his job. So it's all about staying focused and making sure you know, what you're supposed to do. Put in perspective what it means to be up 2 1 at this point. Say it again? Put in perspective what it means to be up 2 1 at this point in the series. I mean, it's great. You know, it, it, feel, it always feels great to, to win a playoff game, especially at home. Uh, on the road. Uh, no, it, it, it feels great. You know, you just gotta stay humble. You know, there's always like this high that comes with, with winning a playoff game. You know, stay humble, stay hungry, and just get ready for the next one. Thanks, Joe. Thanks, Joe.